Good morning, Grove family and guests, and happy Father's Day to all our dads. Grove's theme for June is living your best life. We'd like to know how you are living your best life in June. Share on our Facebook page what activities you've chosen. Pastor Mariner would love to hear from you. Parents, Jungle Safari Vacation Bible School is only eight days away, and we've added things this year we know your kids will love. You can sign up after service in the Tree of Life area or on our website. Create an opportunity for ministry and ask your child to invite a friend. For more information about teen events in July, read your bulletin or log on to our website to register. At this time, we'd like to recognize our fathers. Dads, it's true. You get the short end of the stick sometimes, especially compared to Mother's Day. I can't even front. Women, we get showered with gifts and cards and all kinds of cool stuff. But Father's Day rolls around, But seriously, the importance of a father's love and acceptance goes far beyond words. All right. Yes, sir. Now, you're not an adult till you're 18. Do you want me to be your daddy for the next eight years, son? Huh? Yes, sir. You do? <laughs> Why you want me to be your daddy? I have no daddy. You have no daddy? Well, let me tell you something. Come here, give me a hug. It's hard to express how important you are and how much you matter to us. So we talked to a few of your kids and asked them what they thought about their dads. Um, the thing I like most about my dad is we can play around a lot a lot and have fun. Not like one of those dads who you have to be all serious. He's funny. He is loving and he cares about me. He's funny. We all gonna say the same. Um, how he's so professional and how he does his work and how much pride he takes in his children. Because he loves me and I love him too. He always is there for me when I'm feeling down or sad. I like how he always, like, he's cracking jokes and he's just so funny and fun to be around. That he cares about me. He's always there for me and I can uh, talk to him about anything. He keeps a roof over my head, gives me food every day, put clothes on my back. If I could give my dad anything, I'd give him a boat because he always wanted a boat. A new car. A zillion dollars. He really likes cars. Since I'm going to be famous and rich when I grow up, I will buy him lots of cars. I will get him a new bowling ball because he's one of those people that's in leagues and stuff. Love and care. I will give him a ticket to see his dad again because his dad is in heaven. So I would want him to see his dad again. If I could have one quality like my dad when I'm a parent, it's just to always be there for them and to just understand my kids. Have a strong work ethic and to never quit. My values, my education. He always say that dream, that wish will come true. And if it comes true, that means God did it all. What I think it means to be a father or a dad is to care for your child and love them no matter what. Being a dad is, well, if you have a son, you need to teach your son how to become a man and teach your daughter how to become a lady. It means to be there for your kids. You're gonna have to pay for his college. Protecting that person. And I also think that it would be a wonderful thing too. You have someone there that not only that you're there for them, but they're there for you. The way he expresses his love to me is even though he doesn't have to say it, I still know that he loves me just because of the way he treats me. He treats me like, like I'm a princess, like I'm his only princess. I'm the princess to him. He tells me he loves me every day. Like sometimes he'll call me just to tell me that if he doesn't see me that day. He says it every day. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> well, every time we have like, a, like things to do with your parents, even though he lives like 45 minutes away, he always comes. We, he, we always hug before, before I go to bed because what if he didn't wake up in the morning or I didn't wake up in the morning? That would be bad. We would be mad at each other. 
You probably have friends that don't have fathers. If I didn't have my dad, I don't know what my life would be like. Um, wow. Um, I really would not know. My dad is my life. He loves me and I love him too. My life without my dad, I would be completely lost. Like, my dad just does so much for me. And some of my friends don't have fathers, and it's just so sad. I don't know what I would do without my dad. The first time I played um, football, when my dad took me to football practice, and I was like, and I was like, I'm, I was so nervous, and dad said it was going to be all right. My high school graduation, and he made it in just in time for the graduation. And when I saw him, I felt like that's the only person that I wanted to be there for real for because I really don't see my dad every day because he's in the Navy. So, like, it was, it was really special to me to have my dad at my high school graduation. Um, Dad, um, just thank you for doing everything that you do already. Um, you raised me, made me a good child. Um, I love you. Happy Father's Day. Dad, I really look up to you, and no matter what, I'll always, I'll always love you, and you'll always be the person who I look up to.